The Orthodox Russian religion that permeated the country was never a serious concern for her. She knew that those around her were not representative of mankind. Someday she would find her kind of people, rational, purposeful, happy people, and that a proper life would begin beyond the border. I, in general, hated Russia, pre-communist and post-communist. She thought it was a mystical, backward, uncivilized country, that it was perfectly logical that uh, the czarist regime should give rise to communism, and that the only thing to do is get as far from it as she could. It is the ugliest and incidentally most mystical country on earth. But they're, they're the ones that decry atheism. They're singing your song. Oh, no. I'm sorry, decry uh, Christianity. I'm sorry, decry religion is what I meant to say. No, they really don't. They have a materialistic mysticism of their own. Because if the mystics, the religionist people, tell you uh, the mind, it, well, they don't speak of the mind. But usually the soul is the only the thing of value about you, the body is evil. And the Russians will say, no, there isn't such a thing as a soul or a mind. There's only your body. It's materialism. They and believe that you're not a man, but a collection of atoms. And give that body to the state for the collective effort of the... That's right. For the good of the whole and sacrifice to the state. And whoever says it is or wants to be the state. 